Tell us a little bit about you, love. Um, I'm 50. I have three grown up children. I live just south of Sydney. Um, I, my husband and I have our own business, um, so I do all the clerical work. Um, and we lead a rather hectic lifestyle. Why did you come to me? What was going on in your life and your health? Well, I just wanted to lose weight. I sort of um, let myself go too far. And I thought, okay, I'll just lose weight. But then when I heard more about your program, it was like, yeah, I need to get my head sorted out. I didn't have confidence. I didn't feel comfortable with myself. I was always overwhelmed with everything, I suppose. I um, Yeah, I'd stressed out a lot. I wouldn't sleep. I just felt yuck. <laughs> I just put it down to be pre-menopausal and then I thought, well, no, this is just not the way it should be. I didn't want to continue that way. And, um, yeah, so that's why when I talked to you about all the things that you could help me with, I jumped at the chance. In three to four words, how were you feeling? What were, like, the predominant feelings? Tired, bored, um, worthless, yeah, just miserable. And what... Why did you choose this program over any other program out there or weight loss program out there? I had done some of your programs in the past, so I trusted you. And I knew, yeah, I knew how wonderful you were. So, I, yeah, I put all my trust in you. And what happened during the time we worked together? So tell us about that. I learned so much. Um, I learned, yeah, to, to focus on who I am and how to read my own feelings and, and what my body's telling me. I've never done any of that before. I really enjoyed working on the, the mindset. Um, I did lose weight, which was good, but it was more the psychological part that I thought was, was really, really good. Yeah. Um, I'm now much less stressed, more energized, sleep better, um, feel yeah, so much better. I never really felt that I fitted in. Like, you know, when I was a kid, I struggled having friends. I just sort of felt different. Yeah, I just didn't feel worthy. I felt like I had to do 110 things just to, to be worthwhile for people to appreciate me, which was really silly because it wasn't really the case, but I needed to teach myself that. Yeah, and uh, I got, just got to a point where I just was sad a lot and... Yeah, it just got overwhelmed with everything. It did. Yeah, so I put on a lot of weight and, and, yeah, and I wasn't sleeping. So then that sort of flowed onto other things and the digestion wasn't very good. I was bloated all the time and felt off. And would you say that that impacted your eating patterns as well, or the foods that you were craving or how much you were eating? I love cake cooking and, and sweets cooking. And um, so, yes, I used to do a lot of that and, you know, always trying to make the kids happy and giving them treats. So I was always cooking the wrong things and um, I would overindulge. Mm. So if it was there, I would eat it. Thought it was a comfort thing. Um, just overindulge way too much. Yeah. Okay. And then, so what was it? So if you thought it was a comfort thing and you realized it was a comfort thing, like what was the, what was the breakthrough for you of understanding things? I suppose all the um, delving deep into why was really interesting. I found just going back through my life and thinking, you know, what things are affecting me? I didn't need to eat for comfort. I didn't need comfort. I just needed to just analyze why I'm doing things. And it was just mindless, I suppose, mindless indulging for no reason. And, but analyzing is, that was a big thing, I thought. Mm. What was the turning point in that? What, or what did you learn that was like a turning point or caused a turning point? Um, the habit mastery, that mm -hmm. part of it, I really enjoyed that. That sort of helped me understand, you know, why, why we do things. Um, and breaking them all down, trying to figure out, you know, don't try and fix everything at once and just work on one thing at a time. That was really good. Um, and doing my mindfulness classes with Danny, that was incredible. I'd never done anything like that before. And um, that was a real, that really helped a lot. Mm, yeah. To, just to help me to understand me. Yeah. And what was the result of understanding you yourself more? 
I'm a lot more content now. I'm not um, trying to please everybody else. I'm happy in my own skin. And um, yeah, it's just, it's a lot more, I'm a lot more confident and I'm not worried about what I'm going to say. I'm not going to worry. I'm not worried about embarrassing everybody when I open my mouth. <laughs> you know, I'm just, yeah, I've got to know myself better and accept myself for who I am and, and understand a lot better. Yeah. And how does that feel? Wonderful. Yeah. It feels very empowering. Mm. Yeah. It gives yeah. me the strength. Mm. I feel that in you. It's such a big shift from when we very first talked three months ago. <laughs> I think my first interview, I cried the whole way through it. And that was perfect. <laughs> <laughs> and look at you now. <laughs> yeah, very happy. <laughs> How are things different now? Just, I think it just helps me to, to be happy, to, to not stress out. To, I don't suffer from anxiety anymore. I'm, I don't expect too much out of myself. I, I rest when I think I need rest um, and I forgive myself for, for cheating on my meal plans and it's, yeah, a huge turnaround in the way I, I look at myself and I think I've always sort of had a diet where I thought I've got to lose the kilos. This time it's like I didn't lose anywhere near how much I wanted to lose but I don't care. I'm happy with me. Mm. I'm finally happy with me. What are the like tangible changes that happened in your physical body as well? So on the lines of like energy or sleep or digestion. I, I sleep better. Um, that was a huge thing I needed to try and work on because I, I just wasn't sleeping. I'd wake up two to three times during the night. So yeah, now I'm sleeping a lot better. Um, I was always bloated. I felt like I was nine months pregnant all the time, even from the minute I woke up. Now that doesn't happen, might happen maybe once a week and that's about it. My skin feels so much softer and fresher and much better. I feel so much more toned and my head's a bit clearer. <laughs> How did these changes impact your work? Well, I was, I was really struggling to, to go to work. I just didn't want to be there. I'd hate being there. I didn't, I didn't like what I was doing and I wouldn't, couldn't focus on anything and, you know, I'd be there for two hours and then I just I'd be bored and I couldn't focus so I wouldn't do anything now I'm getting to work a lot earlier a lot more refreshed I'm doing so much more work I'm focusing so much more I'm achieving a lot more at work and um, I'm taking on new things new responsibilities and it, it's helped a lot yeah yeah and how do you feel now in three to four words I feel energized. I feel happy, um, confident. Um, I feel like I can just just keep on going. What was your favorite part about the program? The weekly mentoring sessions. I love that. That was really good. A lot of times I didn't have an input, but I learned so much from the other ladies. They were very inspirational, and it was it was lovely to be amongst a group of amazing women and learning from everybody. It was great. And what would you say to someone who is watching this and who's considering maybe doing this program, but they're not sure if it's going to work for them? I'd say just go for it. It will work. It's the best thing you could do for yourself to invest in yourself, um, to learn to love yourself and to understand yourself. It's the most important thing we can do for ourselves. And I'm sorry it took me so long to, to get onto the bandwagon of doing this. It's, it's fabulous. Yep, don't hold back. And what type of women do you think would be, would this program be beneficial for? Who would this be good for? Any woman. It's good for us all. We all need to be able to believe in ourselves and, um, and understand ourselves and understand our body. Thank you so much, love. I'm so happy for you and so excited for you to continue on this path and um, take things to even higher levels and continue that empowerment, confidence and everything you've achieved so far and even maximizing that. So, so happy for you. And it was such a pleasure to have you in the program. Oh, thank you, Nick. It's been wonderful. It's turned my life around. Thank you so much. <laughs> You're so welcome.